my goal is to try to get people who can't understand where we're coming from, where where, where you see what's going on in the world right now. I, I panicked a little bit. <laughs> hey, man, I'm bringing back, bring back the old days. But I was always ready to go. Like, uh, anytime you show up to the party with this, it better be drink. Hey, yo, what up? How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of the Men and Means Podcast. We're back again for you guys. Episode 65. Damn, and 65. 65. That's a lot. All right, yeah. You're almost at 69. That's like the best number That's ever, the magic so. number right it there. It is, right? Yeah. You're not going to stop at that. Continue. Never. Continue. Never stop. Okay. Never stop. We got a All guest right. today. Yeah, we got a guest, man. Let me let me give let me give this guy the just introduction that he is due. Uh, this is a good friend of mine. Uh, pretty much my cousin. I'm going to call him like that, yeah, man. Um, this, uh, this man is a, is a hustler. This man grinds. Um, family man. Takes care of business there. Um, all around good guy, man. Um, Julio. What's Julio, What's What's what the fuck is going on, my man? Hey, I'm having a good welcome, day. Welcome. I'm here in the garage with both of you motherfuckers, dog. Loving this no, shit. No, we're not in the garage. We're in the studio, dude. <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right. We're in the studio. They can't see what they, you can see. So just let it go. Just let it go. They can't see it. There's a sign outside that said garage, bro. What the yeah, fuck? it's a garage uh, studio. That's what it is. Oh, okay, garage studio. Okay. I anyway. But yeah, man, so we got Hulu here, man. We'll jump in a little more about him and his world um, a little later. But as always, man, we would like to just kick everything off with what we like to call whiskey time. Um, and so with that said, man, this week what we're bringing to you is called Jura. I, I'm assuming that's how you say it, Jura. It's like Jurupala. Yeah, something like that. It's something like that. Yeah, yeah kind of close. Um, and and as always, we jump in the presentation first. So, Julio, you're a new guest, man. What do you think about the look of this bottle here and what what it comes in, and um, where, where are you sitting at with that? I like it, bro. I like the shape of it, bro. You know, they, I think they're kind of symbolizing like a woman's body, bro. I like how it okay. shapes up and down. I can see that from the top and around it goes down, so yeah. the middle goes out. Or so again, again if you yeah, guys, bro. Yeah, bro. You guys can see that. It's, that's it. It's right a good there. looking body, bro. I um, think that's what they're going for. You know. <laughs> Okay, but James. I thought it looked kind of like a mouthwash bottle. Agreed. Okay, you know, like okay. Listerine. Yep. Hey, that's better than Listerine, bro. <laughs> you know? Let me tell you that. It probably does the same Listerine. job, right? Kills all the germs. This has been our COVID nineteen repellent. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Over the past year, so I, I, I kind of that's fine. It's suited. Yeah. Okay. okay. Um, and for me, man, what, what the, so I want to make, make sure I mention too. It does come in a nice uh, tin case. Um, what a nice green forest green, if you would. There, um, tin also, case. That's also a good sign. I, I do. I like the I like the case better than I like the actual what the actual bottle looks like. Um, however, for me, when I first saw the bottle, my thought was this looks like Kirkland Signature brand. Um, like the, how their bottle would look. You know what I mean? Um, okay. Okay. So from Costco. You know what I mean? Wholesale, baby. Hey, that, but but those bottles from Costco are also pretty good too. Bro. I heard that. I heard good, that. Bro. I've heard that and I've heard opposite. You get, you get bang for your buck. Oh, you heard opposite. What was opposite? Um, I've I've heard that. Well, I mean, just let's just to jump into what Kirkland does, man. They just outsource it from someone else and then slap their label on it. So first off, you know that's already kind of disappointing. Um, but it, it is the biggest bottle I've ever seen. Yeah, of it whiskey. Is, bro. I you was like, those, is you that having a really... party? You have a lot of people over. You go over there, bro. You get those bottles, bro. You're set. It's a big fucking bottle. Is it? It's a big bottle. I don't have a fucking Costco membership, man. Neither do I. I seen it at a party, and I was like, what the hell? It looked like one of those like novelty things that you see at the club when mm. they pull out a bottle. It's mm-hmm. oversized. Mm-hmm. It's like one of those. I was surprised. Like, so maybe this is like the the, the mini version. It's the, baby, it's the it's Sam's Club it's... edition. <laughs> you know what I mean? Dude? No, let me tell you this, though, bro. I went to a wedding, and it was a cop wedding, and let me tell you, they had. All those bottles. Yeah, because cops stuff. usually Everything. fucking party harder than anyone Everything. else. They do. <laughs> yeah, they do. It's like they sponsoring Costco and they hooked them up with all the <laughs> yeah, bottles yeah. wedding, bro. Yeah, yeah, it was man. crazy, dude. We've had and some they finish them. Well, we had some cop events. They fucking finish them. Yeah, they, they don't fuck around. No. I'm like, how did you get home? Because that's not really fair. No, I, <laughs> you know I, mean? I drank but, responsibly, okay? No, I'm talking about them. Responsibly. Oh, yeah, them? we always drink responsibly. Well, they they pulled out their badge. They were like, hey, yeah. Okay, I'm a cop. Well, we'll, we'll escort you home. <laughs> <laughs> you want us to drive? Hey. Yeah. I'm just, just jealous. You know what I mean? All right, man. So, all right. So that's the presentation, man. Um, my man over here says uh, woman's body. My man over here says it's a Listerine fucking bottle. Listerine bottle. And I say it looks like Kirkland's signature bottle. Okay. Oh, I don't know if any are bad. I say Julio's is probably the better fucking one there because who's mad at a woman's body? You yeah. know what I mean? It's very descriptive. It's shape. It is. It's got that hourglass vibe going on. I get where you're coming from. Um, so as always, man, let's just move on over to the uh, the the nose of this bad boy, shall we? So here we go. Hello, hello. That's what you say. Hello. Oh, hello. Yeah, yeah. Well, do it again. Knock, knock. And how are you? How are you? 
I'm pretty good. <laughs> you answer it? Are you want to answer it? I don't know, bro. It I'm asking a question. I'm answering, bro. I'm sorry, bro. But hey. No, it works. You can, you can answer it's, it. It smells good. I like the smell of it. For me, I'm getting a little alcohol. Yeah. Like I'm, prevalent. I'm getting a lot of alcohol. And I'm getting a little cask. There's a little cask in there for me. No, I smell the cask too. But but alcohol for sure is prevalent yeah. on this one. Yeah. yeah, I'd say, yeah, you definitely get the alcohol vibe. It's a little sweeter on the nose as well. Um, I can't finger exactly what it is. <laughs> Finger. Story of your life. <laughs> yeah. Boy, is it. <laughs> um, I guess kind of fruit. You know what I mean? Like uh, kind of that sweet like fruit vibe. Not like sugar, but like a fruit. You think they use green apples because the uh, color of the bottle? Maybe. A lot of times they do use apples. Are you sure? Yeah. Does it say anything on here? No, I don't think. Yeah, a lot of times, yeah, we'll get a little background. But overall, I'm going to say, you know, it... it it's a pleasant, pleasant on the nose. Um, it's not overbearing. It's not too alcoholish where it's like fucking. It just kind of oh, yeah. distracts from the overall. Or, or like it burns your nose when. You yeah, exactly you right. Or you see people, you gotta plug your nose. I don't yeah. think. I don't oh, think you gotta shit. do that here. Bro, I worked at the Double Tree Hotel. And let me tell you this, bro. There's a lot of Muslim weddings and stuff like that, boy. You Muslims, I thought they don't drink. They don't drink, bro. But they don't believe in deodorant either. So. <laughs> oh. Wow. No, no disrespect, that's took no a turn. No disrespect <laughs> to them. Their culture's <laughs> No, I'm telling you, bro. Like. Yeah. You know, hey. Like, I, 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 smiled worse. I dated a white chick that was like, yeah, no, I don't I don't fuck with deodorant. And I was like, well, can you? <laughs> you know, no, nah, I'm fucking around. <laughs> well, I, I think the, the sweetness you're getting is from the ex-bourbon cast they use. Yeah. Yeah, I mean. And so this, that must be what, because so it, it is faint. We it's should faint, highlight too. Not really, you can't really pinpoint it, but there's a slight sweetness there. I think it comes with the bourbon cast. Right. We should highlight that this is, it's what well, this is Jura single malt scotch whiskey seven wood, right? Yeah. And, and that's not a golf uh, term there. It, it seems it's, like a golf term. It does, right? right? I heard is, seven wood. Seven wood I is, about is a golf club. But this is actually referring to that they actually uh, partner this with um, seven different casks over the time of their uh, aging it. Um, and, and that's going to be French and American oak cask. Okay. So, But do they only do that for seven years? Well, I mean, and so here, so it doesn't even the say. thing here so is that they don't a distinguish. Year, a cask? Well, they a don't distinguish what, what how long this is aged, right? And that doesn't mean... Well, but like, you would what, think, the key word, seven. Sure. Um, but they, so they could blend this with other, like, different batches. Um, however, as it's a single malt, it just means, to my understanding, that that means it comes from one distillery. So they've made it all in-house. However, that doesn't mean that they're not blending it, like, to, uh, this batch here with this batch here and then getting it all together. Yeah. And it's seven different, like, Cask that it's going through, right? See, seven different casks. So, so different casks. well, that that's can, a lot. Like, I don't, I don't even recognize a lot of these casks. So, like, it'd be interesting to like label these out, like maybe on, on the description or whatever. Sure, because I'm gonna Google these later. Hey, Probably but, won't, but but do you think, <laughs> do you, do you sounds think nice. The people that made this bottle, do you think it was like a family recipe, and they were just handed down the recipe, and that's how they do it? Well, I think what so typically. Just, well, I mean, the the distillery says. In, from 1810, right? 1810. Okay. Um, so I, I don't know if they did or not. I think. But what I would, what I would appreciate a little bit more with this one is if they told us it was a 10 year and it went through seven well, casts in right. that 10 year. But there's nothing here, so they could have gone through a year, you know, like where they they rotated it out every six months or something. I don't, I don't right. know the duration that it stayed. Well, well, yeah, here. we we don't know. What right? we do know is we're getting a little slight sweetness, but the cask, it, it went through seven casks. Right. So it's nice that. It's, there's alcohol there, but it's also there's cask there. I'm, I'm I'm smelling that, so it's nice that we're not missing the cask. Because if it's seven cask and you do, you don't smell any of it, yeah. Well, the, what was the purpose? What the fuck is the purpose? And, right. And we don't know the the aging and, on this, but what's the price point on this? Well, yeah, uh, the price point is about eighty bucks, right? But oh, I do want to highlight the bucks? fact that this is like the, the appearance of the actual um, uh, liquid itself is darker, right? And so I, I I'd imagine that it's a lot of soaking that in from the cask. Kind of has like a Jim Beam look, you know, like the darkness of it, the way it looks. Does it? I don't drink a lot of Jim Beam. I, I do. I used to drink a lot of Jim Beam. Uh, yeah, I'm not mad at it. I just, it, you know. No, Jim Beam is good. I drink Jim Beam when it calls for it, yeah. 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 When, it calls for, yeah. when it calls for it, I definitely it's like fuck with Jim Beam. It's like your body ties your Jim Beam. You're like, okay, yeah. Jim Beam. It's, it's a Jim like, Beam day. Why the fuck did I say that? My body has never been like, it's a never? Jim Beam day. Never? Never. Never? But you tried it, though. I've had it, yeah. So why? What were the circumstances? Because it was what was there. Oh. <laughs> That's why, you know, I was like, all right. I guess but this what you, did you hesitate at first? Like, ah, uh, Jim Beam. Uh, yeah, usually. Usually I'm like, fuck. Ah, okay, well, we got a Jim Beam. Fuck it. All right, let's do it. Jim Beam's like a day drinking whiskey for me. Yeah, it is. is it? it is. That's it where, is. like, you're looking to have fun, get Ooh. smashed. And... Me? Like, if you want to, like, day drinking, I go Malibu. I like Malibu. Ah, yeah, yeah. Bro. Fuck that, dude. What the fuck are we give me some, give me some Malibu pineapple. What are you, what are you on the fucking beach somewhere? Yeah. 
Yeah, that's no. the you know, we're in California, dude. You gotta and live I'm it up. Malibu is gonna be a <coughs> peanut fucking colada. That's it. Like I don't know. Fuck it. that, dude. You had peanut I'll, I'll make. I yeah, like yeah, yeah, they're good. Man. Yeah, but I'll yeah. fucking take that and pour some pineapple in there, and I'm having a good damn good damn day. That's right? sugary yeah. as fuck. That's gonna yeah. hit you at the end. I'd rather pour the the rum and now and the pineapple. Yeah. Oh, I'll get yeah. Captain Morgan too. Yeah, just pour that straight. But the Malibu is a little too sweet. The one fifty one, never straight up because that's a bad experience. The one fifty one and that shit will be. Yeah, I can't do that. Well, anyway, so yeah, so this is about 80 bucks, man. Can we can we try it? Can we Let's see what it. we're working no, with right. here, guys? Cheers. 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 All right. It's pretty smooth. Surprisingly smooth. Yeah. It's smooth. I get the little the smell afterwards after you swallow, I get that little burst of smell that comes into your nose, hits your nose. Mm -hmm. And then you take a deep breath and you swallow again. Then the fucking smell and the taste combines together. Oh shit! Yeah, no, yeah. De definitely, it is like that. It's like it's smooth and then it comes back with yeah. that alcohol. It's, it's peppery. You get it's smooth. It's easy to go down, it's like but, a it's, but it's, it comes back like you know this is what yeah. I want you to miss. It has yeah. a little taste <laughs> to it. Don't, don't miss this. Yeah, don't miss it. It li it lingers a little bit. Uh, yes, it, it kind of lingers not, a little. It's bit. not the most flavorful one that I've had. It's fucking linger. It's a no. fucking lingerer, man. But I okay, hate lingerers, okay, man. But, but okay, <laughs> it's smooth though. Okay, in that case, yeah. like flavorable. If you're doing flavorable, that means you're doing like mixed drinks with whiskey. No, what no, if no, guys no. Just like it. Well, that like and that's so I, yeah. like I think that, that's though. a common misconception. I think we we we. Um, pretty much solely drink it um, straight here. Yeah. And but we've had some where I'm like, damn, you know that packs a lot of fucking flavor in it, oh, right? Okay. okay, um, okay. Um, especially Other flavors pop in your head as you drink. Yeah, it. like oh, there's okay. some. I mean, like some of the times we're drinking, I'm like, this shit tastes like apple juice. Okay. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. holy shit! That's you a know? fucking crown apple with apple juice. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> or just crown yeah. apple on the rocks. Well, <laughs> that's a good go over. Or or it, or it's so strong that like it can withstand a mix. Right, and that's yeah, when, that's so what we typically we would go, go with. Kind of call those out, right? I, I don't. I, honestly, I I don't know if I would mix this one. I, I mean, the alcohol flavor is there. It. But I don't. I don't think it's it's overbearing to the point where like it would stand out in the mix too heavy, because I think it does have that sweetness and does have some yeah. flavor with it. it does. It's just like you said, like that the alcohol kind of kicks back up yeah. into the nose. It's like and, a little rewind, and then it kind of just lingers yeah. a little bit. So it's it's it, I like it. Um, it I'd say I'm overall, surprised. it's it's not. It's it, from I, what looking at the bottle, it looks like to the bottle to me sells like sounds or sells itself as being kind of cheap. Yeah, but you don't see the bottle right away because it's in that tin can. Well, that's why so I that bought tin it. Can, fucking can, I know, exactly. So the me. tin can, <laughs> so the tin can puts that illusion out. It does, not the bottle itself because you it don't does. know what you're looking at. But I, I'd say too, though, man, um, I, I'm pleasantly surprised. Right, like it, it's a good taste. It, yeah. it, it's smooth. It is. It's, it's a little sweeter. It's. It's um, got that pepper, still that kick to it. Slight smoky. Uh, a little bit of smoke in there. Not yeah, no, nearly no, no, no. like I the taste smoke. And stuff, I taste but the smoke. I taste there's some smoke in there. Um, we got went through seven casts, so. Well, I mean, yeah. Better pick up something. I'm sure yeah. that so some one of them was charred or something. You know, I wonder yeah. too, like if you like charred the first one and then let it kind of like so, dis so, dissipate out. So maybe that's it. Maybe it's just seven barrels with different types of whiskeys. And then at the end, they combine them all together. Well, that's what I was saying, right? Then they, they can do that, provided yeah. that all of them were made in the same distillery. Yeah. You still can call it single malt. Well, I mean, the the thing, yeah, single malt, yeah. same distillery. That's, that's okay. But single the thing malt. is, like, white oak, ex bourbon cask is the first one that goes. So it is charred. So it is so charred. charred. Yeah. Right. So so that's probably the one that they probably hinge a lot of that first flavor. Upon. Right. Right. And then they kind and of. And I swear to dissipate. God, I'm gonna try to sound these out for the listeners <laughs> yeah. out there. But limosin. Troncais, Allier, Vosage. Oh, yeah. Those, yeah. Are, Wait, those, that, are, those are. Is that French or German? I, those are French. Those are like wine. French, those are like right? wine barrels, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, those are French. It says Jubilis. American and French. Yeah. Oh, it's American French. American and French. Oh, that's uh, what it barrels. says, though. That's okay. So they, yeah. they've okay. probably gone through wine barrels. I didn't know that. And yeah, I'm sure. Kind of sweeten them yeah. up and kind of. But I, but I honestly. Yeah, there's no process to that. Exactly. There's no process to it. The the white oak ex bourbon cask I think is what they really want to punch it with. Well, yeah. and they did a good job of that. That was in the beginning of it, right? That's right. the first ones you read. Right. Fuck yeah, it is. So, I think yeah. it says he from they like whatever's at the top. That's our main. So thing. I think they yeah. turn it all the way up, right? And then uh, they slowly turn it down as they with they're the, going. Exactly. Right? You know what I mean? And yeah. that's how they're kind of filtering that out a little bit. So you still you still get it, which I like, right? Like yeah. I want that there. Yeah. Um, however, the, too, the we've cool, had some that are overbearing. The still cool, house. The cool thing too, shit, no, still house is cool. <laughs> no, the good thing, the cool thing though is that like they have seven different casts that they've gone through. I know that they hit that sixth one and they knew like, no, we need a little bit more. Yeah. Obviously that's how they end up with the well, seventh yeah. one, right? They, and the then they time. call this the seven wood. 
So apparently they they knew it. They want they still wanted to kind of mellow out whatever flavor was there, and it went through seven casks. And you know it got sweeter as it went through. Yeah, and it still has a kick. That says that they 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 actually tried to play it that way. Yeah. So I. I I mean, one more cast, it would have been called Awood. Yeah, I know. How, how, how would that look? And how would that, if you would read that right now? How, how many Jerua, more casts before Awood. it's a driver? Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> Fuck it. Okay. I don't know. You know? Well, Jerua. Driver coming out. Yeah, 2023. 2023. That's how they age it. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> yeah, dude. They're on the links. They, yeah. Tiger Woods, I guarantee you, Tiger Woods is probably linked to this shit then. If it has anything to do with golfing, Tiger Woods probably Tiger Woods better stay away from drinking. That guy. Yeah, I know. <laughs> He's going to have another wife. How many yeah. wives? <laughs> oh, fuck. Yeah. <laughs> fucking guy. He He's, just can't mix the meds with alcohol. So, you know, he yeah. spent enough to have a he bunch does. of them. But oh, hi, shout out Tiger yeah, Woods. Yeah. I know he's listening. Yeah, please sponsor um, us, man. <laughs> we're here. We're here. Do we're it. Here. Let's go. We're here for the taking. So, yeah. Adam um, Sandler. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's that. an too, bro. Um, yeah. But so overall, man, let's 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 rate this thing, man. We're uh, Julio, you're the guest. Um, if you had from a one to a ten, where are you gonna go? Ten being the absolute best thing you've ever tasted in your life, one being the absolute shit. Uh, where do you sit at with that? I give it a solid eight. Solid eight. Yeah. Okay. Solid eight. I'm gonna give this one uh six point five. Six point five. Six point five. Oh, I don't have a fucking calculator. You son of a bitch. We won't worry why about that why would now. you need a calculator right now? Because I gotta do an average, but James is gonna write it down. He doesn't have a pen. We're average. ill prepared. Okay, I give it eight. All right, so we got a we got a eight but, and a six point five. But yours I feel is a little stronger just because like I see your whole alcohol collection of whiskeys. Yeah, so if you, you guys can't drink yeah, way more for you guys now. that can't see at home, man, we have we, uh, we have a good maybe amount. twenty bottles sitting here right now. Yeah. You know what I mean? So uh we should have sixty five. I bet but we were fucking going in. So and are, those, are those yeah. the top shelf behind you? No, no these are just the shelf? ones that ended up there. Oh, I mean okay. yeah, well, for sure. I would think they were like <laughs> top shelf, second shelf. This is one of my favorite ones. Okay. Yeah, that one looks good. This, this, I didn't, I didn't can notice. We, can we can we get a little taste of that one a little bit later? Yeah, yeah, yeah of course. You can taste whatever. Yeah, yeah, whatever you want. You hey, wait, 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 wait. Go easy with what you're gonna say. <laughs> right now. Yeah. Watch the words like a bunch of. Yeah, I got some good taste. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I bet you do. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, so we got an eight, six point five. I'm gonna go nice, easy uh, seven. I'm gonna call it a seven there, and I'm gonna seven. give a little background. You're going with my straight seven. with the bottle. Why? Um, I think that shit's. Telling you to say seven. Well, I think look for me, man. It's it just it's 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 good. I don't, yeah. the presentation was kind of shitty to me. I didn't care for it. Um, not to say it's terrible, but or that that that's everything. But it does play a role in, in our rating system okay. here. Um, and I, I I wish I knew how long it was aged. I think that would be nice to know. It doesn't say um, on the bottle. It does not. Um, and Why don't we Google it. Just Google. It. You okay. know what? Because Google, the, the distilleries that don't it. the distilleries that don't disclose the age on the bottle usually don't disclose it to anyone. Oh, like that's how they're okay. going to get down. It's, that's that's okay. their proprietary information. How long they age things or whatever. But but don't they know that um, they get people that get curious about what they're not reading? On sure. The bottle? I, I, like, yeah. But therefore, uh, like one of you, like I mean, there's it, a yeah, lot of them it, that it, don't. And also, yeah. it deters some people. Yeah, yeah because it does. It looks strictly for that aging mark. Right. Honestly, honestly, when he said that, I asked him like it didn't say on the bottle, and I was like, no, it didn't. No, but a lot of them don't. Right. Like we have a lot. We've had a lot here that don't, and and I think too, to, to a point, right? Like if you make it, so let's take Lagavulin, right? So you have your eleven year, right? Okay, 11. But so you know that that's aged in that barrel for eleven years, and then sixteen, now you're going up and you're going up. They're doing that, and that's the way they're doing it, right? That's that's how it stands. Whereas this one, they're they're they have their process, and they're not they're not making. I mean, this this distillery makes different kinds. Um, however, this one they don't dis- care to disclose. They have ones that they call out the age, but for this particular one, it's not. That's not their main fucking claim to fame, right? Oh, okay. um, so that's not their best bottle. Uh, probably not if you're going to yeah, determine it based on age. If, if if that's all you, what some people are, it's just purely age. Um, then no, this probably isn't. They have more expensive bottles. Yeah, um, but, but when it comes to like wines and like dark liquors or, or we'll yeah, see. no, actually no, just dark liquors because I don't think tequila has an age like oh. How, well, I imagine they have to age it well, for well, a certain time. They, they have classes. So, like, yeah. you have the Blancos and the uh, yeah. Respados, Respados and the Añejos. Añejos. Those are based off of, like, aging. So, oh, you know, okay, okay. if you hit that one distillery, you get, you buy the Añejo, you know it's aged the longest. Okay. And then we'll say okay. with wine, too. Wine isn't necessarily aged in a cask, right? Like, they bottle it and then put the bottle away. Yeah. Yeah. And so now you're like, so oh, I got, a, I got a fucking 1994. Yeah. And so you're like, oh, man, that was a great year, right? It's, it's not grapes. so much. It's yeah, based on the year of the, the How the harvest shit. was and right. the, 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 the rains and all that kind of shit. I, from my understanding, is more important with wine than it yeah. is in this in the 
and and then like a, then like American whiskey, anything under like two years, they just call it a whiskey. Yeah, you can't call it you can't call it bourbon. You can't call it. It's not a bourbon. It's not aged. Yeah, they, they just call it a whiskey. To be called an American bourbon, it has okay. to be aged for a minimum yeah. of two okay, years. So bourbon legally. is basically off like how long you're aged. Well, just to basically. call it, just yeah. to call bourbon. it that. Yeah, it has to be a certain amount of time. So yeah, there's that. Yeah. So I, I'm not mad at. So, I don't know. They might have done it fucking a month in each one. I have no idea. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. But but based off of the, I think the scotch, number of casts that it's gone through. I think to call a scotch, there's a minimum amount of time it has to be aged as well. Probably. I think I want to say it was like four years. I don't know about scotch because I know scotch is from Scotland. It is. So I, but, but see, like a, a bourbon, American, like a, a American whiskey and a bourbon and a Tennessee whiskey. Are different things. They're all different. Yeah. But they're whiskeys. But you can't classify them. You as, can't say it's a bourbon without it being that. Same yeah. as like a rye. Has well, to be a, a bourbon also has to be 51% corn. Corn. Yeah. Whereas a rye has oh, to be right. 51% rye. Well, right. ryes, no. The ryes ha- are usually, yeah, I think 51%, and they can go up to 99%. Sure, you could go way over, but yeah. it has to be minimum of that right. to be classified as such. So, th- But see, my point is like, I, I don't know. My, my whole point is that it's gone through seven casks. It's got an alcohol kick to it, which I do appreciate. It's got a slight sweetness there. You can taste the cast. You can taste the 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 char. And it doesn't burn your insides. And it doesn't fucking it. burn. It's not overpowering. Yeah. I think they did a good job on this one as far as like not disclosing that. Because some you get and it's oh, yeah. just not that good. And it might detour you from it. If I saw it, it was like, oh, age three years. I'd be like, oh, fuck this. But you also know? if I found out that they put this shit in, in seven different casks in, in, in two years... Or 18 months. I'm gonna be like, what are you guys? You guys working to? Yeah, yeah. Well, leave it in one. Let, let it chill. I mean? like, yeah, yeah, let it hang fuck out. Fuck the seven wood. Let's get a three wood. <laughs> yeah, you know that's fine. So, I'm not mad at the the flavor profile that they've created. I think it's kind of overkill because I don't know what all those other casts are. That's why I hit it with the 6.5. I don't really know what they're doing. Sure. I just know the end product is not bad at all. Well, and, but, and where do we end up at? Without without all that, if you could just give an opinion based off how you tasted it and how it made you feel, what would you give it? What kind of points would you give it then? Without knowing that it went through seven casks? Without knowing seven casks. If that didn't bother you or anything, that wasn't a um, part of you. Purely based on taste. Then. Just purely based on taste, what would you give it? It, it wouldn't go above a seven for me. Okay. So I still yeah. say 6.5. Still 6.5, 6.5 around 5. seven. Okay. Because yeah. cause, cause to me, like the alcohol kick is, it's not as flavorful mm-hmm. as there is a component of alcohol kick and flavor. Okay. So right. if, it had, if it had more flavor and it just made me smile when I drank it, then I then I'll boost it up to an eight. What's nine. that flavor though? Let me get you. I'm curious. Uh, that, that flavor, flavor is like a good strong cask flavor. I'm okay. getting the cask, but I'm not but getting not like a strong, robust. Wanted, it doesn't have as much body. Okay. It's got more of a kick and like you said, that lingering effect. Some have, to me, the ones I rate higher have good cask body flavor and all goes through, and they're super smooth. And and there's not a lingering effect yeah. until your next drink, and it just oh, keeps okay. yeah. you keep okay. like the it's flavor like build, profile, it's like a build up. Yeah, it's like, like it just that flavor is just good enough to just it's, it's, hold there. It stays. It, it is stable enough. Yeah, that's I why think, I kind of view. I think maybe what we could do too is once you once you got that one, if you'd like to try one of the other ones, I would. I think we'd we suggest you'd see a little more of what the the cask and the smokiness and those kind of things. Can, yeah, that, I, how those I would, offer it. I would because I love whiskey and I go base. Uh, like knowing whatever you guys are talking about, I go based off whiskey. On uh, when I drink it, the effects it makes me feel, like how it makes me feel. Yeah. Uh, is it the alcohol too strong, where it's overbearing, and I can't get none of the flavors in my mouth, so I can't taste anything about but the alcohol, and I'm regretting it because it's burning me like a motherfucker. Yeah, it's too harsh. So like that's how I go based off whiskey. Yeah. But like yeah. looking into it, like how you guys look at the cask and all that stuff. I know some somewhat of like the casking and like right. process of everything like that, but the whole terminology and just being like. Used to it. Well, man, you know what? Uh, tune in every Monday. We come out with a new one and, uh, you know, I know some, we'll kick I, some I, knowledge. I, I, dude, <laughs> yeah. I, dude, I try to do that, bro, but as a father, bro, like, oh, no, no, time, no, I'm with totally my daughter. Fine. Totally and fine. I'm not even on my fucking phone. I forget to have my fucking phone. My, I'll be like, where the fuck's my phone? And my girl's like, it's over there. I was like, over fucking where? I don't remember where the fuck. Yeah. I left that. <laughs> like, where? Well, anyway, let's let's wrap this up. Um, uh, do we have an average here? Yeah, average seven point two. Seven point two, man, which Strong. is a good one. Strong. Yeah, um, seven point two is good. Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a little good. pricey. Oh, yeah. It's a little pricey. And the price point. I wouldn't yeah. pay that price though, bro. Like, I'll, I'll, oh yeah, it's I'll, a little pricey. The only time I'll do that is if I'm out on an outing or like. Oh no, I, would, I wouldn't do it out. Oh my god, I don't. I don't think Ken would buy this one again for eighty bucks. Yeah, so what, I, what, I, what, yeah, what I if Ken never tasted it and someone convinced him to do it? You think you'll pay eighty bucks? He has got a good. No, I've never tasted this. I just walked in the store and was like, "Fuck it, I'll get it." I know that. <laughs> you know what? And you still pay the price though, right? Yeah. Oh, okay, see. 
Yeah, I didn't, you know, whatever. But, I mean, like, okay, would I have done this if I was going home just to drink? Probably not. I wouldn't have bought this. I'd buy something I know better. No, um, okay, but, so that's if you tasted it before. But see, I'd say for me, though, that's the benefit. That's the benefit of you look, if you could see all these bottles here and yeah, all of this. The, the benefit of me, of us having done so and drinking all of these, is now I know when I go in the store and I'm like, hey, you know what? Like, I want to show off a little bit. I want to get someone something good. Okay. I know what the fuck I'm getting. As opposed to just being in the store like, I have no idea. Jack Daniels it is. And I used to be such a Jack Daniels hater, and now I, I have more respect for what they do. They, they've, they've found their market, and a lot of people love it, and they, it's the most popular one in, in America for yeah, sure. That's good. And it's synonymous with American whiskey. Everyone, it's not even a fucking bourbon, but still. And no one know. else does it. It's Tennessee. Yeah, yeah. But you know what's funny? Everyone says that Jim Beam's is a little brother. That's Jim Beam's little brother right there, bro. So that's why I don't understand like how you never got into the whole Jim Beam thing. Yeah, I, I never did. Um, he he latched on to, to Jack it. Daniels pretty strong. For yeah. a while, yeah. When I was yeah a lot younger, I was but I was it, all it into Jack. It could have easily been Jim Beam that you hooked. Oh yeah, whatever. You know, what just, like right just, then and there, I think it was like, like that one day in my life. It, yeah. it would have been something else. That would have probably been where yeah. I would have went. But yeah. um, instead, I mean, for God's so. sake, this guy's saying Malibu day drinking. I'm, oh, I'm not shit. Malibu's that. a great oh, wait, day drinking. You know what I mean? Like I'm not. I'm Malibu's not. You heard it. I heard it. We all heard it. Everyone heard it. I said it for everyone. It's a great day drinking. No, it is. Look, dude, if I'm day drinking, I don't want to get fucking trashed. I don't want to. I don't want to be in bed by fucking five. No, you're going to be in ride. Just wave. You're not better if I stop, bro. Yeah. No, I'm not. not. Yeah. You're gonna wake up at five with a major fucking headache, regretting. Oh, no, oh, what me. the fuck did I drink? Not me, sir. Malibu. Not, not me. Malibu. Not Malibu you. doesn't that's have no payout. Me. Unbelievable. Yeah, that's the downside. Yeah, but that's also the upside. It's like okay, if you well, make it right, and you'll fucking get there. Okay, yeah. same with fucking Captain Morgan. They're the same ABV. You know what's fucked up? I'm looking at all these bottles, and then I look at Ken, and then I remember his response about the fucking Malibu. I'm looking at all these bottles. <laughs> How in the fuck do you get Malibu, bro? Like you could have picked any. Any other better rum I know. This guy's that was a, darker that could compare it to your fucking bourbons, your rice, hey, and everything else that's on the I don't the give a table, fuck, bro. okay? I picked Malibu and I'm sticking with it. You're bro, right. Your panties dropped <laughs> when you said Malibu, dog. Like, I picture him wearing like a bikini uh, bottom and shit, shit. Like a, like, Surprise, I'm not wearing any panties. <laughs> and and oh, when he daydreams, no panties. Oh, yeah, no shit. panties, daydreams. Especially yeah. yellow polka dotted one. I'm bro. ready to go. You're like, you're like fucking sponsoring pineapple, and somewhere in there is Malibu. <laughs> Just hidden. What's like wrong with that? Friend. That's a good You're time. You're a fucking guy oh, with fuck. short shorts and yellow polka dots. You guys were Malibu talking about fucking sponsor. drinking Fireball a minute ago. Get, fucking, get your big that? red. It was no, no, no. Get your fucking big red and get out of my it face. It was a comparison. A it was a comparison. Okay. It was no one talking about hey, drinking dude, it. Malibu is fucking fine by me, man. Yeah. Okay? Like, and yeah, you're right. I, that's when I'm not trying to get trashed. Bro, my Look, respect dude. for you was like up here. <laughs> and you said Malibu is like right here. Hey. And I look at you, I'm like, you're not going to go way back up there right now. I've never dropped. Oh, uh, <laughs> you dropped those panties. Just like the panties I did Malibu. Have Malibu, you so panties <laughs> Malibu, you know, like, you know, Grey Goose make your girls. Malibu, fucking, yeah. Was it, was it Grey Goose make your girl feel loose? I don't, look, dude, I no, don't know. Malibu don't do makes you feel loose. No. Look, you know what, man? I'm secure in who I am, and I'm not worried about it. And you know what, man? Why don't somebody chime in and tell me they like to drink Malibu too? It's a good time, okay? No one good, chiming. clean, wholesome fun for the whole fam, okay? You're going to subscribe, and we're going to unsubscribe you if you fucking agree with the Malibu. <laughs> <laughs> Unsubscription. We we'll don't give a fuck. No, we won't. Okay, yeah. we'll take them can't, all. Can't well, you know, can't well, but give him a couple, couple cups of Malibu. Yeah. That's what we'll never remember. <laughs> he might link up with you on a day drinking mm, escapade. Oh, shit. It'll be a blast. Yeah. yeah. It probably would. Hey, you know what? I like that idea. You got to bring we homeboy. Should, what, you, what's you, homeboy's you, name? Oh fuck off, man! Uh, we should do something though with um where you know you win a day to hang out with the Minamines and you get to fucking drink Malibu or whatever it is you want to drink during the day and, and we'll have a good time. I think that'd be a good thing to do. We can auction them off. Full closure for sure, but you had to have contracts. <laughs> yeah. Whoever comes in, you had to have a contract. Non disclosure. Yeah, non disclosure, everything, bro. That we need an NDA. To be we gotta get NDAs. <laughs> no, <laughs> yeah, bro. No, I'll be fine. Safety? I'm drinking Malibu, bro. guys. I'll be fine. Okay? No, then leave the paperwork out of his fucking hands <laughs> they and the pen. Them. They're gonna need Because this fool will be on a fucking rampage. Trying to game. swallow it. Oh. <laughs> they, that's a given. <laughs> keyword, I mean, keyword, swallow. We've taken a very weird, very weird turn here. And yeah, it's, I'm sure it's a lot of fun for everyone. But Se you know what? Seven point two is a strong rating. And my it is a strong rating. 
I yeah. gave Jura. It, I, what did I give it? Jura. What did I give it? Eight? 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 Exactly. So it came out to a total to Well, what? I think, too, the 7. fact that the, 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 exactly. the, the, the guest here today gave it an eight. So that's probably more of an average rating for most people, right? right. And so I, right. that's a good depiction so of, I think, like what it would be. So that's like an agree to disagree kind of situation, right? You no. Agree no, I'm just saying. I, it was solid. I think we just drink a lot of whiskey a lot of the time, you know, once a week for sure. And so I think, yeah, we're looking at it a little different. But I think that's what is relatable to the listener. Can we're not, that, we're, hey. not, we're not far off though. I mean, you guys yeah. are a point away. Can yeah. I say can I say something real fast? Sure. Can I, can I intervene? Let me just say you guys inspired me. Every two weeks, I'm gonna pick up a different bottle. There you go. No, yeah, I like that. When I get paid, I'm gonna buy two bottles actually. A bottle for me, a bottle for you. Yeah. And I gotta take a picture of all your selection because I don't wanna buy you guys re bottles, but she you guys are drinking. There you go. Well, some you know? of them you could, and I wouldn't be. No, bad at okay, it. then then <laughs> yeah, I'll then do, then yeah. I'm gonna fucking give you a list and you're gonna write out the list like a hey, write me if you buy these. Write down again. Malibu. I'm fucked. No. <laughs> I'm never gonna touch or buy Malibu, dog. It's fucking fine. You're not dude. even a girl I want to fucking try to fuck. Like, wow. Why would why wouldn't you do that? I feel like Malibu is like non-alcoholic. <laughs> kind it of, is, kind right? Of is. You know what I mean? Like, I, I like, feel like look, if you no, buy a no, bottle no, no. Of Malibu, you know what they You did? show up with it, I'm like, well, hey, what no, you, I get what you guys are doing? saying, guys. Wait, wait, can I say something? I get can, it? Can I say something? I, you know what they did? That's the they, attraction. They they, they 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 combined it the right amount of sweetness. With alcohol, so when that combination comes together, it forms, it forms a, a solid. Stand the fuck Let's up, show me your vagina. I'll take it. I'll show take it, guys. Vagina, Ken. It's the show most, me your vagina. It's the most your boys. No, get. but it forms. It forms. You guys are something else, man. It forms. The and powers it's like, combined. Yes. <laughs> with our powers combined, <laughs> the force is with you. I'm Captain Vagina. <laughs> Dig. No, man, that's your you nickname. That's your no, nickname. No, that's Captain. your nickname, man. No, no that's, fuck, fuck that, dude. Though. Okay, no, I look. No, 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 here it is. No, Whatever. No, 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 Whatever. No, no, no. Whatever. Yes, I picked that. That's and your I nickname. have my reasons for it. it and they add up. It sticks with you. We'll let it ride. Uh, Moving on. So you're, you're going to ride. <laughs> <laughs> you'd fucking like that, wouldn't you? You'd fucking like it, you dirty dog. Save you. a cowboy and just ride. <laughs> wow, you got that down, huh? You uh, dick, you. That's your so fucking bumper you. sticker. That's your. That's the bumper sticker on your fucking car. I'll never put a bumper sticker on my car <laughs> ever. ever. Save a horse, ride a cowboy. Hey, this guy. What the fuck? <laughs> Cowboys butts <laughs> drive me nuts. This is your next one. Why do you know all of these? Dick, oh, I read it on your god. bumper sticker. You got Dick, cowboys in your... Malibu. Oh my god! Oh, <laughs> no, that's that's what we call we call we call it broke back mountain. <laughs> <laughs> Malibu gets involved. We call right. it it's broke back mountain. So yeah, because well, I'm the mountain. one that's not drunk. No, but, you, but you guys are. Yeah, you know. No one's drunk. <laughs> no one's drunk. No, not now. But when I'm sipping my Malibu, you guys are doing all the weird things. Nah, and I'm just. <laughs> Fucking, I'm gonna, I'm gonna show everybody this That's later. That's like we took a half, fuck. and you took a whole. You see what we don't see. I would take the whole. Exactly. Oh, in your mouth. Okay. That dude. Wow, this is turning really sexual. <laughs> so moving forward. All right. Um. So I have a question. Why are you surprised for? I'm not. You know how many times we hung so out and how sexual you get. You. Let me tell people oh how touchy God, you get. Jesus you get so Christ. touchy and I'm funny. <laughs> oh you rub my <laughs> leg like I just bought you a twenty ounce stink. <laughs> I'm just kidding. That's just off record, you know. Uh, off, <laughs> off record. That's yeah. off record. If this is number one. It, number one. If this was Men in Black, you guys are done. Flashy You're thing. Flash, that flash thing. You guys are no, done. No, and first off, um, I literally feel like I'm 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 on my P's and Q's because I feel like you're gonna molest me every time I'm around you. You, you grope me you're like Arnold Schwarzenegger, and I'm like, get the fuck off of me, bro. There's <laughs> a camera pointing to Drake Ladders. I haven't touched you once. But you know how many times your leg has come close to my leg, bro? Like you're just what's trying that to, big dick energy, dude? Nah, no, that's, that's the big dick energy. I got to open up. Footsies you know what I mean? is still a thing? I never knew footsies was still a thing, bro. Like, hey, well, footsies? fucking re- open a fucking book, man. You know what I mean? Footsies are there. Look, I got a fucking question I'd like to ask, right. and I'd like to get into it. God damn it. Okay, but ask fucking, the fucking question. All right. 